I think Fred Warner is probably the best well, linebacker Fred in the NFL. Warner, I also think and, and that Jason Verrett is one of the best the corners in the league. All I want is for let us stop tearing the man down by coming up with these bogus claims as to what happened. You How weren't there, bogus? Mike. You weren't there. It, you decided. Okay. You just told There's me so much that he's video not playing against. You it? just said he's not playing any ones against defense. And I said, well, who's he's, Fred? He's only Fred playing Warner's a, a one. Jason Verrett's a one. Yes. Okay, you just named two. Oh, no, I'm just the saying. 12, 12 that's who picked him off. I understand that. The two guys picked him off, yes, because Jimmy <laughs> Garoppolo is not capable in practice where he is. Hands off, can't be touched, can't throw the ball accurate enough to get uh, receptions. I think it's not about accuracy. It's about being stepped in front of and picked off. That's a little different. I mean, oh, I so in other it. words, you're saying Jimmy Garoppolo can't see the field. No, no. Richie James was supposedly cutting across the field, from what I understand, on that play. And Fred Warner read Jimmy's eyes and cut across the field and took the ball. I, I know. And and the ball was three foot, four foot away from Richie, Richie James. James Jr., and went so what, straight so what, to it. So why didn't Fred just stay where he was? He didn't need to race across. He, he the was. If, if you heard what everybody said, Fred Warner was just standing there, and he well, threw the ball right to him. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait. What was with the eye read and that type of thing? He just stood there, and Jimmy threw the ball right to him? Come yes, on, Mike. Come straight on, up. Mike. Come on, come on, come on. Watch the tape. Right. Type in YouTube. Jimmy G's interceptions. They'll come right. up. You can right. watch it for yourself. Right. Yes, right, Fred Warner just stood there, and yeah. Jimmy G threw the ball right, right to him. Because and maybe he, he likes Fred. Clueless. Well, about the Jason Verrett pickoff, you got. I guess you he threw it right to him too. No, he actually threw the ball about five yards too short, and he caught it. Mm. All right. Matt Miyoko even said it. There's your yeah. guy saying it too. He threw the ball yep. five yards short. All right, Mike, go ahead and develop your point a little further because I, I okay. Much, My point is, is Jimmy one. Garoppolo can't do nothing but five yard dink 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 all day long. That's all he's did in, in, in practice, other than about three passes that went over five yards that yeah. were receptions. One of the best passes of the day was thrown to Ross Dwelly the other day. It was kind of deep downfield, but don't mention yeah, that. Yeah, 20 yards. Yeah, and I'm giving mean. him three of them. It was yes. more than 20 yards, Mike. No, that's all it you was, know, was I, 20 I, yards. I, yes. here's, what, here's what works me up. If you're going to say something good about one person and then say something bad, just tell the truth, Mike. That pass was only 20 yards. I'm telling the truth. He threw two oh. interceptions. That looked no, I, well, everybody knows about that, but then I said right. Ross Dwelly's pass downfield, one of the best passes of the day, and you said okay, it was a during, during the pass. Super Bowl, it was Emmanuel Sanders was yard deep. Pass. Okay, during the Super Bowl, Emmanuel Sanders was how far open what are we going on that one Super pass Bowl that he for? overthrew him by 15 yards? Well, he can't throw over five yards, according to you, so I don't know how he made that all the way no, down he the couldn't. field like he that. he couldn't. That's why we lost the Super Bowl, yes. No, he okay. couldn't read George Kittle open three times in the middle of the field where he yeah. could have dinked and dunked it. For first downs, also. All right, all right. Mike, I'm trying to cover question, up from Jimmy Is G, and I don't your, understand why. I, well, I understand the so, bitterness of uh, a lot of people toward Garoppolo. You're but making Mike, yourself look bad. No, but listen, isn't it that you are pissed off about the Super Bowl? Is why that you're. No, I'm not pissed agenda, off about the Super Bowl. Yeah, no, 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 I'm I swear, right but your biggest Bowl. agenda is about Jimmy. Mostly, that's when I first met you, you were talking about Jimmy, and he wasn't supposed to be here now, and all that stuff. So I think oh, no. at this point we, we had a bet way back you, and I said if you gave me the unbiased you take, the quarterback and you said, Oh no, no, no. If you I gave me the right. unbiased take that. with Grog. I told you to write it down, remember? I would actually listen. But right now all I hear is hatred and bitterness because of the Super Bowl. Hate because Jimmy G's horrible. We drafted a quarterback, but, traded three first round picks and a third round pick. There's a reason why. Yeah. He didn't want him. We tried yeah. to get Andy Dalton. Why would we pick up Andy Dalton? That's horrible because Jimmy G's worser. If Jimmy you know, G was hey, such this big how, superstar, hey, hey, where Mike, are all the picks from how do you Andy? Know the, Andy, how do you know Andy Dalton wasn't coming in to back Jimmy up? There was no confirm, confirmation on no, that. No, actually, they weren't coming back him up. We had done traded up to the third overall pick. He was coming to back up Trey Lance. Okay. Well, you know, they you had just that gotta, you got you got to open no your need. eyes. Mike, there was no need to go to Jed and ask him to keep two quarterbacks. If what you say is true, why in hell did they go and tell Jed we need to keep Jimmy? They didn't tell Jed. They asked. Did they? 
Oh, come on, like Mike. Every time Cal See, that's why and, and when I listen to you talk, when I listen to you talk, I know it's going to be a one-sided affair. You know nothing about them asking Jed about that. Are you serious? All I know is every time that Cal and John open their mouth, they're pathological liars. What? There ain't no competition. There ain't no press conference. Then it was why, a pre- why is Mike, Trey Lance getting all go, these reps? Google it when up. Mike, I'm not going to argue with you about this. It happened. Ask, just Google up. Jed York gives permission to sign J- Jimmy Garoppolo and draft the third pick in the draft. Ask. Oh, I'm sure they talk to him about that. Go I, look I, it up. Because you know, you're not going to believe me. Rats, you know, whatever. Well, I'm I just saying. know Jimmy G is no, because horrible. You're coming He's in here with half with a page of facts. With a red jersey on means you can't be touched or whatever jersey And the other half of all your opinion. That's not going to work with me. I read as much as you do. It's not opinion. It's fact. The fact well, is, I don't know anything about Jed. Jimmy you know G's nothing about Jed York and, and them asking Jed York could they sign Jimmy even if they draft the first round pick. Did Matt Dillon not say that. Uh, he's Trey's beating the you know what out of Jimmy? In oh, practice? that's fine. I'm just wondering how you didn't know about that. The God, Matt Miyoko of football, Niner football, says Trey Lance is whooping his ass. Nobody's disagreeing with you, Mike. I just four workouts. Well, why do y'all want to keep him? He's a $53 million Russian roulette. Because we've had four One ACL, workouts. One ACL, $53 million. And some of us need more than four workouts with no pads on. I'm sorry. I mean, I, I understand speak that. You, and know, with you no, don't contact, need no contact yeah. to the quarterback, and he's still uh, throwing interceptions. Uh, still not going to be in contact. But it's still going to have a different play from everybody else on the field. Mike, we got to go. Well, All right. Anyway. I understand. Yeah, you don't, yeah. You don't want to hear the truth. Well, no. You, know, you, need, to shut, you need to shut your We can argue down, all night. It's being horrible. I mean, I could argue with you for 24 hours. It, I, I, that I think, doesn't I'm, matter. You need I'm to shut trying to let somebody down, else you just get in. You're not even, right. You have to clue. Bye, Mike. All right.